Hello, who is? Thank you very much for being back with me. I appreciate your precious time watching and following this channel. And I pray that God bless you for all the good things that you are doing for the channel. We love you. And I say, continue supporting the channel. God bless you. Today, we are going to look at the former the presidents or the leaders of the Gold Coast that is now called Ghana from 1844 till date that is for 2022 so if you are new here please don't forget to subscribe in order to get a new in order to get a new video that will upload first the British government, they rule Ghana, they rule the Gold Coast from 1844 to 1957. That's where Ghana gained independence. From 1957, Dr. Nkoma came as Prime Minister of Ghana and he ruled Ghana from 1957 to 1966 when his government was overthrown by a military coup. And the name of the military coup was what? National Liberation Council. So after after Nkuma was overthrown, it, the successor of Nkuma was George Atta Anka. That's a general, it was a military government. So he also led Ghana from 1966 to 1967. That's where he collected he received bribe. He was found of receiving bribe from a Nigerian businessman and they or they changed him, they forced him to resign. So after that, uh Afrifa took over from him from 1967 to 1969. That was a military coup. And from 1969, Ghana went to what? The Second Republic. The Second Republic, we had election. And the election that we had was a parliamentary system of election. We had elections, and the elections, the, the seats were 140 seats. And the Progress Party, which was led by Dr. Kofi Abrifa Buzia, he won 105 of the seats. So Dr. Uh, Dr. Buzia became the president. He became the prime minister of Ghana. So it was a parliamentary system of government. So we all they elect electoral carriage, electoral carriage. They used electoral college to elect the ceremonial president, which was Edward Akufu Ado. That is the father of the current president of Ghana. So they ruled Ghana from 1969 to 1972. From, they ruled Ghana from 1970, I beg your pardon, from, they ruled Ghana from 1970 to 1972, where uh, the military came in again. The leader would lead. The military or the, the one who took over from uh, Buzia and Edward Kufuado is I.K. Echampong. I.K. Echampong also ruled Ghana from 1972. You know, I.K. Echampong also ruled Ghana from 1972 up to 1978. From 1978, he was also, there was a Paris coup. That is, the military is surrounded. Those who were, who were with him, they also do. We call it Paris coup, and they changed him. And the one who took over from him was FK General FK Akufu. He also ruled Ghana from 1978 to 1979. From 1979, Warren's Chamarones came in June 4. It was also a military coup. June 4, 1979, he came in, and he what? He he what? He stayed until September. 1979 that they allow election to take place so they go for election after the elections dr hilary imam won the election so hilary imam came as what well, as president when hilary imam came as president hilary imam also became president from 1980 to 1981 from 1981 warriors came in again Chama Rollins also came in again. He came in again, was 
1982. And that time, it was a government. He lived in Ghana as a military man. So 1992, they went for a constitution. They rewrite a constitution, and they were, that was the, the Fourth Republic. And they, they went for election. And Chamarolis, he came in as well as elected government, that's democratic government. So he won the election from 1992, and he took over as uh, democratic government from 1993 to 2000. From 1993 to 2000, and from 2001, President John Ajepi before also take over from him from 2001 to 2009, that's 2009, 2009. From 2009, Atamel also took over from him from January 2009 to 2012, where he died. He died. He, when we were about to go, when there was election, we were about to go for election, few months to go for election, he died. So, John Mahama and the NDC government allowed John, the vice, his vice president, John Mahama, to lead the party. So, John Mahama was a president and from, then, from 2012 to 2016. In 2016, he lost election, so, so therefore, Nana Akufuado came in as president from 2017 to date. Thank you very much for being part with me. This is a simple and summary of the leaders of Ghana from 1844 to 20. 22. So Nana Akufuado will rule Ghana from 2020 from now to 2024 and they will vote a new president. Thank you for being part with me. I appreciate your precious time as I said for being part with me. And don't forget, if you have not subscribed, please kindly subscribe in order to get a new notification and new videos that will upload. Thank you and God bless you.